In this presentation, we will talk about the two possible ways to open a file. Then we will take a look at the parts of a file name. Finally, we will talk about folders and subfolders and show you some examples of how to save files in a particular folder. There are two ways to open a file using File Explorer or using the application the file was created on. Let's begin by opening a file using File Explorer. The file to open is Module 1 Resources. Open File Explorer. Find the file. Place the mouse over the name Right double click to open. The other way is by opening first the application used to create the file. To know which application was used, look at the last part of the file name. The three letters after the period are called extension. The extension tells the application needed to open the file. Files with extension doc are text files that open with Word. Files with extension JPEG are image files that open with Microsoft Photo. And files with extension PDF are read-only documents or forms to fill that open with Adobe Reader. Let's use Adobe Reader to open the file Module 1 Resources. Click on Adobe Reader. Click on File. Now click on Open. Find the file you want to open. Click on it to select it. Finally, click Open. PC computers have preset folders to store files. These preset folders are documents, downloads, music, pictures, and videos. Inside a folder, you can create subfolders to organize your files. Let's create a subfolder Nico course in the documents folder. Open File Explorer. Click on the documents folder to open it. Click on the folder icon right on the top of the screen. The new folder is created. Name the folder Nico course and click on it to finish. Most folders on the internet available for download are PDF files. For example, in this course, you have the option to download transcripts of the video presentations. To do that, click on the highlighted word. It opens the file. Click Download. This will open the file in Adobe Reader. Now go to the left upper corner and select File. There, click Save As. This will open the window to select the folder you want to save the file in. Choose Nico course. Then click Save. Finally, the main points to remember are files can be opened using File Explorer 
or an application. The extension indicates the application that opens the file. Subfolders can be created in folders to organize files. This concludes our presentation. Thanks for watching. Thank you.